Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. Welcome to my channel if it's your first time here. My name is Latia B. As promised, in this video, I'm going to be talking to you guys a little bit more about the Shidavi Hair, Skin, and Nails vitamins. I mentioned that I started taking these vitamins again in my last two videos. I did one video where I used the Shidavi hair care products to style my hair for this wash and go. If you want to check that out and see how I styled my hair using their hair care products, then definitely go ahead and click the link up above in the cards. I'll have it there for you guys for easy access. I'll also leave the link down in the description box for you guys to find very easily as well. Shadavi actually sent me these hair, skin, and nail vitamins and I was actually supposed to take them for 30 days. However, I received two bottles so I will go ahead and take them for a duration of 60 days. I've already gone ahead and done a length check before I styled my hair for this wash and go. I did do a length check that same day. So basically what I did, like if you guys been watching any of my growth challenge videos then you know that I was using like a black t-shirt that said Jet Beauty of the Week on it and I've kind of been just using the letters to help me like gauge how much my hair has grown however i wanted to be a little more accurate now that i've started taking these vitamins and i decided to go ahead and use a white t-shirt and mark my hair as it grows and also put the date for each marking so that we can see how much my hair grows in 30 days and then also in 60 days I do want to let you guys know that I'm not taking any other supplements at this time. So I'm only taking the hair, skin, and nail vitamins along, of course, with my regular diet. And then I am incorporating the length challenge and growth retention and making sure that I'm wearing protective styles and using products that are like beneficial for hair growth and promoting thickness and things like that. Because I am doing all of those things that are supposed to be helping me to promote growth and help retain length, I do believe that these vitamins, they should, you know, be able to help. I'll push that along a little faster so we will see if that is the case so in each bottle you do get 60 capsules and i do believe i talked about these vitamins in a previous video like i remember i talked about these before and someone asked me recently if i'm still taking these vitamins and i told them at that time i wasn't but i am taking them again now so if you're watching this video here we go we getting back into it this one is for you but yes there are 60 capsules that come in each bottle so that's a 30 day supply you're supposed to take two capsules a day so i usually take one capsule in the morning with breakfast and then my second capsule either at lunchtime or with, at dinner it doesn't say on the bottle that you need to take these with food but it does say that you should drink at least the minimum recommended daily amount of water because I'm kind of like I don't know weird when it comes to any type of supplement I try to take them with food so that I don't get enough to the stomach or anything like that now that we have talked about the serving size and how I like to split up my serving size let's go ahead and dive into what is inside of the vitamins so the first thing on here listed is biotin now there's a lot of biotin in here it says that there's 4,000 ncgs of biotin per two capsules which is equivalent to 1,333 percent of the daily value biotin is a water soluble vitamin that's part of the vitamin b family it's also referred to as vitamin h your body uses biotin to help convert certain nutrients into energy and it also plays an important role in the health of your hair skin and your nails the way that biotin works is actually by helping to strengthen the infrastructure of keratin. Keratin is the basic protein that's found in your hair, skin, and nails. There have been many research studies that have shown by taking biotin for like 90 days or more, people did see some growth in their hair. So that is why a lot of times when you get a new vitamin, they recommend that you take that vitamin for 90 days or more before you start to see results. Because if you only take it for 30 days or 60 days, you may not see the results that you want to see taking them for a longer period of time will really help you to determine whether or not that vitamin helps. After these 60 days, I will see what my hair is looking like at that point. If I want to continue using the vitamins, then I will purchase more, but we'll see as time goes on and I'll be sure to keep you all updated on, you know, like my process, my progress and all of that good stuff. These vitamins also contain a proprietary blend of MSM sulfur, alfalfa leaf, pumpkin seed, bamboo extract, kelp, amla, hibiscus, goat to cola, moringa, shisandra berry, shatavari root, anan, tamul, bringraj, dosi, kamut, licorice, mangista, ruibos, <laughs> and sal palmetto. Now that was a mouthful. I'm not going to bore you guys by breaking down all of these products, but I do know that MSM sulfur is one of those things that I see popping up in a lot more hair, skin, and nail vitamins. So I do kind of want to talk to you guys about MSM sulfur. MSM sulfur is methyl sulfonyl methane is a sulfur chemical that's found in plants animals and humans and it can also be chemically made MSM is known for its anti-inflammatory properties and it is commonly
commonly used as an oral supplement to treat arthritis pain and swelling for a number of conditions. It's also available as a topical solution to help reduce wrinkles and eliminate stretch marks and treat minor cuts. So according to research, it says that MSM sulfur can form bonds essential to strengthening and influencing hair growth. And some of the MSM rich foods include coffee, beer, tea, raw milk, tomatoes, alfalfa sprouts, leafy green vegetables, apples, raspberries, and whole grains. And of course, eating those um, items when they're raw state will definitely give you more nutrients and there will be a higher presence of MSM. And as far as side effects go for using MSM as a hair growth, aid research has shown minimal to no side effects from using msm supplements so that is good but of course if you're pregnant or you're breastfeeding or anything like that you definitely want to make sure that this is safe to take by talking to your doctor or if you're already taking other medications or anything like that then definitely talk to your doctor before starting this supplement or any supplement for that matter aside from msm sulfur the other ingredients actually are pretty like recognizable to me like alfalfa leaf hibiscus pumpkin seed all of that good stuff there's also a few Ayurvedic herbs in here which y'all know I'm on my you know Ayurvedic herb tip so I'm happy to see that some of those herbs are included in this supplement and the nice thing is that these supplements are made with the vegetable capsules so they are vegan friendly I'm actually really excited to see how well these vitamins work for me I really like them because one they are easy to take I'll actually show you guys how big they are like don't let the size of the vitamin intimidate you because while they are a little big they actually are very easy to ingest and swallow whenever you take them with water I usually like take really big gulps of water in regular life so whenever I take these I mean it's the same thing and it goes down very smooth very easily I also really like that I don't have any like weird discoloration whenever I go to the bathroom because I was taking some vitamins before and it made my pee like highlighter yellow and I know that's because of everything that my body did not absorb from the vitamin it was you know being excreted through my urine and I would be like um I know I drank a whole bunch of water today so the nice thing about these vitamins is that I don't have that issue I have heard quite a few people say though that whenever they take pills that are high in biotin they get like really bad breakouts thankfully I haven't had any breakouts like pertaining to these vitamins I mean I have on makeup right now but if you follow me on Instagram and have been watching my stories and you've seen my skin I haven't had any breakouts aside from like my usual like monthly breakout that I get from my hormones changing and fluctuating but yeah I think so far so good so I'm really excited to see how this journey will go. I'm about like 10-ish days in taking these vitamins. So once I am finished with this first bottle, then I'll be sure to give you guys an update before I move on to my second bottle. If you are currently taking any hair, skin, and nail vitamins, definitely let me know down in the comment section. If you're interested in taking the Shadawi um, vitamins and you have any questions, definitely let me know. I'm 100% open to answering any questions that you may have. Anyway, you guys, that's all that I want to share with you for this video. I just wanted to make sure I touched the basis with you guys let you guys know i am taking hair skin and nail vitamins again and i will definitely keep you guys updated throughout this journey with that being said i'm gonna go ahead and close out this video thank you guys so much for watching i will see you in the next one and do not forget to stay dazzling